Making music and being creative is the only thing that keeps me going. But I never expected to be a singer. Since I was young, I could look at myself from the outside and just see this girl. I'm still me, I'm just evolved, but I have the same spirit, same soul. My hometown in Colombia is busy, colorful. Todos están afuera, están en las calles, hablando y haciendo negocios, tratando de ganar platica, hacer lo que pueden. When I was little, my dad had this tape recorder and I used to always steal it and record myself. I would kind of just play by myself and write songs and I just wanted to get it out. I had been writing and I had been, I would always have melody ideas and randomly since I was little, but I had never recorded myself before until that moment. And that was when I realized how much I liked it. I was raised to believe that taking care of people and taking care of yourself and your soul was a lot more important than fame and money. ¿Ustedes de dónde son? De Colombia. Yo soy de Medellín y ella es de Cali. Ah. Pero el carro, esto empezó, mi mamá fue que empezó con estas arepas hace como 30 años. The house that I grew up in when I was little was kind of like a house that you pass through when you first get to America and you're on your way to, to figure out where you're going next. Entonces, como te estaba contando, mi mamá, como de, ella tenía cuatro hijos, no hablaba la lengua. Entonces, empezó a vender arepas en la calle. Era una mujer muy fuerte. Sí, muy berraca, muy sí. berraquita. My tattoo right here is my dad's passport signature coming to America. It's always been something that really inspired me, the strength and the courage that it takes to, to pick up and leave everything that you know. Moving across the country to LA was really tough. My goal wasn't ever to be famous. I think what really made me keep going was just knowing that I never really felt like there was anything else that I could possibly be doing with my life. I felt like this was the one thing that, that made me happy and that ultimately I knew it was my purpose. I think it's important not to care about how people see you from the outside looking in, whether you're going to be misunderstood or praised or whether you're going to be loved or hated. It's kind of a feeling of just giving in and trying to be in the moment as much as you can.